We close here tonight by saying thank you to our colleague John Blackstone. After 38 years at CBS News, he is stepping away from the day-to-day -day grind. 60 Minutes correspondent Bill Whitaker has our toast. Beneath me, the ice is two miles thick. From the South Pole to South Africa and thousands of other stops throughout the world, John Blackstone has taken CBS News viewers on an extraordinary journey with style, grace, wow, humor. So if the cops show up, it could be the bird feeders who take flight. And thrills. The queen herself is... He joined CBS News London Bureau in 1986 after serving as a national correspondent for the Canadian Broadcasting Corporation and moved easily across the map of foreign assignments. Johannesburg, part of Lebanon, Honduras, Cape Town. Here in Ghana, Belfast. More than 4,000 stories over four decades and a benefit to anyone who watched and listened to his modest way of reporting and making great stories. John Blackstone, CBS News. CBS News, San Francisco. In 1987, John Blackstone was transferred to San Francisco. From there, traveled the West, interviewing Hollywood celebrities, even armed celebrities. Right here. Okay, and it stays right here. You gotta be careful with the questions I ask. These strong winds. Alongside the natural disasters, there was the human innovation of Silicon Valley that he reported on from the infancy of the internet to the worldwide dominance of Silicon Valley tech giants. Sunny optimism. Leaving a legacy and a career that any journalist would envy. Whoa! Bill Whitaker, CBS News, New York.